Hello everyone, today, we continue to explore the topic of effectively developing habits. The main content comes from a book called, Habit. The first method is to create clear environment triggers. If you notice that our habits are often triggered by external environment cues. An example of an American soldier in the Vietnam War in 1971 is mentioned in the book. More than 20% of the soldiers became addicted to heroin, but after the war ended, and they returned home, over 90% successfully quit. Research shows that a complete change of environment can significantly reduce addictive behaviors. Combining habits with noticeable environment clues is the key to cultivating new habits and quitting old ones. For instance, I used to love sweets. I cleared all the desserts at home and didn't buy snacks to bring home thus reducing my frequency of eating sweets. The second method is to make the habit more attractive. For example, combining something you like to do with the habit you want to cultivate. Like me starting to run while listening to my favorite podcast. I don't find running boring anymore, and I even look forward to it. The third way is to make the habit very easy, such as simplifying the goal into very easy to accomplish small steps. For instance, start with meditating for one minute a day and gradually increase the time. The fourth method is to create a sense of satisfaction, such as when saving money. Immediately deposit the saved money into an account named after the goal. Seeing the cumulative effect will give immediate satisfaction and thus maintain the habit of saving. Tracking your habits is also a way to discover a sense of satisfaction with a continuous check mark for each day you maintain the habit. Finally, remember that change is an ongoing process. Enjoy this stumbling journey, stay positive, and see life as an experiment. The above are the four methods of forming habits I have summed up. So, what new habit would you like to try in the next 30 days? Don't forget to set a reminder for a month later. Goodbye.